Guys, I wish I had no friends. Uh, this multiplayer is fun and everything, but I'm gonna be honest, every time I fire up this game, the, the further I'm getting into that single player campaign, it's like really hard to like not constantly be thinking about it uh, in the two hours leading up to it. Um, but yeah, we're starting at a normal time tonight. Uh, we have a little bit of time before the maps switch off. 90% uh, of which is going to be taken up by this uh, newscast that I won't dismiss. Listen up! It's going down! Repping the Splatlands, we are! Deep... No, I'm just, I'm just kidding. I can get out of here. Wait, can I? Wait, I can't clicking in the stick! I literally can't! <laughs> I'm trapped! I wish I had no friends. Vine boom! <laughs> oh, it's breaking news! Shiver! You wanna know? It's that time! Hey, hey. Ben, Ben. Splatfest! <clears throat> it's time for a Splatfest. Ooh, I like a Splatfest. <laughs> All right, time to party. What's the theme? What's the theme? Hold your seahorses. The info's still downloading. I've got it. The theme is... Ah, well, that is fascinating. Uh, hurry up and spill it. You're hogging all the Splatfest vibes. Chill. I'm getting ready to announce it. Ahem. <clears throat> come on, come on. Without further ado, this Splatfest theme will be none other than... Didn't, didn't they already tell me this in, like, the Nintendo Direct? What would you bring to a deserted island? Gear, grub, or fun? Yes, I daydream about this one all the time. Fascinating choices. It looks like we get to pick Team Gear, Team Grug. Team Grug? <laughs> or Team Fun. Easy. Grub is food, and you gotta food it up to live. Team Grub. Plus, food tastes good. Hey, hey. You need food to live. Have you tried swimming with your mouth open? Hold on, I'm having a thought. Could I eat a sleeping bag? You know, in a pinch? Nope. Don't ask me how I know how. And that's why I'm on Team Gear. I'll harvest food and be living in comfort, unbothered. And meanwhile, you'll be shivering in the dark, eating ice-cold enchiladas off a leaf. Yeah, but I'll still have enchiladas. You'll have enchilada, and no chill either. Plus, eating is fun. I'll see how much pizza I can eat, then try to break my own record. Who said anything about unlimited pizza? What if all you get is lima beans? Anyway, what's the point of living on an island if it's no fun? I'm Team Fun. Surprise, surprise. Enlighten us, big man. How will you entertain yourself? I'd bring cards. And, uh, different cards. Hmm. Oh, table turf battle cards. I said something fun, big man. Oh, that would be fun. Oh, now I don't know what to do. Who are you going to play against? A caterpillar? And how will you stay warm? Ugh, boring problems. I stick to the acronym K-I-S-S. -S. Keep it salami, stupid. Team Grub. Team Fun for life. Join me if you want to have fun. And that's all for now. Make sure to get your votes in. Don't forget your Splatfest tea. Check the equip menu, menu after you vote. Let's see the current battle stages. Okay, now I can back out. Although I'm always interested in seeing what Turf War is all about. Undertow Spillway and Inkblock Art Academy. Okay, nothing, nothing too special there then. Um... Okay, well, I was joking about- what the fuck is this? Oh, they're, like, getting ready for the festival? I never saw the, um... This- this stupid fucking tease on my home screen. I guess I can, like, delete it now. It's probably taking up a, a, a bit of space here. But, uh, now I don't have to, like, make jokes anymore. I can just, like, play the real thing. That's better. Hey, 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 hey. So, do you think that Big Man, uh, stands behind that TV because he's hiding his giant boobies? I've, I've, for the past, like, two days, I've seen, oh, awesome, uh, I've seen Big Man, Barra Art, and I want to, I'm ready to see, <sighs> I gotta choose my words carefully here, I do not want to see, I'm expecting to see a third one, I promise it, it's not happening to me, is that Star Fox? Miku? Hi, Miku. This is Scarlet. More hedgehogs? Guys, I gotta go to the, the stupid fucking match already. Don't forget to take breaks. This one doesn't count, but I'll, yeah, I'll fresh it anyways. No, it literally is like 7.56, though. Like, whatever matches are currently in rotation are only gonna last for, like, a single match if I can make it without any connection errors. 
But, uh, right now I think the current maps in rotation are, if I'm being honest, like a little boring. Um, oh, I switched to the, the Splattershot Pro before I ended last stream. Uh, that was a wise choice. Um, I feel like even though the Splattershot Pro, like, was in two, uh... I was, like, too married to the Duelies to ever, like, want to go back and, like, give it another shot. Um, but of the little that I played in, in the single-player mode, and getting the chance to reacquaint myself with the Splattershot Pro, uh, I'm open to it. You know, it's been a long time. Uh, we're both kind of different people all these years later. Um, but we're both willing to give it another chance. Because we both remember how it felt. Because, I don't know, the Duelies just, I don't know... I'm certain they can be good offensively, especially when you have the advantage of, like, the dodging and being able to focus your reticles and all that, but, uh, man, you get, like, really good, like, coverage when you're, like, strafing along. You get really good just, like, damage numbers. Like, look at that! I didn't, like, have to think about that. I wasn't, like, zipping all around. It's all focus, no hesitation, and it feels good. Oh, and this uh, special has the crab, too, so I don't even have to, like, Relearn anything new? This I'm like ready to like become better at. I'm ready to like continue training and becoming a, a crab master. <laughs> they should add tripping to this game. Why? I want to see them fall down. The squids? That's like falling, I don't know. Um, you can get like peed on in single player mode. I don't know what to tell you. Yes? Okay, well there we go. Problem solved. Did, was there somebody hiding in here? I could swear that I saw somebody, like, do the big splat to, like, confirm that you're damaging somebody. Maybe they got away. Anyways, this is way too good of a spot to not use the crab. I gotta whip that shit out. I like that the, um, the crab has, like, a, like a separate ink reserve than the player does, too. It makes it really easy, even if you're not, like, rolling away and you're kind of, like, an inopportune spot. Um, recovery is always, like, still a very easy option to make. Oh, other people have crabs here, too. Yeah, what is the, the weapon makeup here? We got someone else's dualies. I think that's, a, like, a splatting, maybe. Um, and then I think maybe, like, a bow and arrow. I don't know what the, that thingy is. I don't know, my weapon's so good. Man, look at how much more reliably I'm getting kills, though. If that's a, the trade-off between this and the Duelies... Should I say goodbye? I mean... The value that it's offering is, is kind of like, you know... I can't ignore that. That's serious stuff. Oh, dude, you're so cornered. You're so, you're so cornered. It's all over, dude. That's right. Yeah, that's what I thought. Friend who is obsessed with the grocery store seafood section. Yo, is it fine if I whip my live crab out? This is what I say when Krusty Sean shows up. Or rather, this is what I say when Krusty Sean doesn't show up, and I'm trying to summon the poor guy. He's still missing. He hasn't been seen in years. Alright, I want to see how I contributed in that battle. Because, I don't know, maybe it was just, like, the specific team that I was up against. But that one didn't feel like a struggle, like it always does with the Duelies. I don't know, this could simply be a matter of warming up, though. We'll see. But I think I felt good about my P. My P number. Let's see. Yeah, 1,066 P. I want to say that, like, for the most part, I've been doing, like, sub-1,000. Um, under most circumstances. Uh, Damn. I don't know what I was thinking. That Splattershot Pro? Splattershot Pro is really, like, old reliable. Without a question. <gasps> Wait, guys! It's them! It's High Tide Era. This is the music that I was talking about earlier. The stuff that I thought it was. Let me get closer to the speakers. Eel Tail Alley and Hagelfish Market. I don't think I've been on either of those stages. That's going to be exciting, then. I 
don't think it actually gets louder with proximity. Listen to this, though. This part goes crazy. I can't believe these guys went missing after Splatoon 1. And we still have fiddles instead. Oh, these are my Alterna items! Oh god, and I had to do my, my stupid gotcha rolls. <laughs> I usually prefer shooters over duelies as slaying weapons, because duelies only perform well when you're in the dodge roll state. Hmm. Yeah, that's the thing. I remember when, uh, when Splatoon 2 first came out, I was a little bit disappointed that, like, when you play with Split Joy-Con, that, like, you only aim with the right gyro. Because I think it'd be cool. Like, it gives you two reticles when you're holding the duelies. That, like, if you could use both Joy-Con and, like, aim completely independently. Um, it'd be wildly unbalanced, but I I'd still kind of want it. I'd be lying if I said otherwise, you know? So I'm refreshing up my locker! They're usually always slower and less accurate than their shooter counterpart otherwise. A bit too limiting for me. I guess the thing about me is that I have a lot of trouble, like, committing to anything. Um, and the dodge roll gives me, like, the, maybe not in practice, but on paper, like, like, the hope of easy escape. Um, I don't really take advantage of that potential, but it is there. Um, and when I look at it in, like, a list of other weapons, I always look and I say, oh, this has the dually dodge, I gotta have the dually dodge. You gotta have the dually dodge, guys. I thought you were looking up there like you were about to say the Hell Valley Sky Trees were up there or something. Well, there is the, the hologram projector. That's a little spooky. What else is up here? We got like the sky, the clouds, the beauty. I want to focus more on like honing on, on, on moving targets here. Oh, well, okay. Just swim away. Sometimes you don't always have that option. You can dually dodge through, like, the, the sloppy ink, but you can't dually dodge, like, you can't swim through that. Oh my, look at these, like, <laughs> blurry texture mountains in the background. Like, really look at that. I mean, it's a more convincing effect than whatever the hell was going on with Pokemon Legends Arceus, but it was it's a little striking to be the first thing that you see. Oh, wow! Take a look at this stage's layout, though. There's, like, rooftops that you can go on. Whoa. There's, like, a lot of verticality, too. It's, like, really open as well. Bro, roller? Bro, bubbler? A likely story. This guy's gonna try and come up behind me. They think they're real clever. See, they're trying to, like, take away my escape routes. Before they go in for the kill. But I'm I'm wiser than this, actually. Oh! I'm not wise! The Splatoon simulation theory. Thank you, Nox! Thank you. Okay, this like, this area still needs some, some proper inking. Is this inkable? No, that's all, like, tarped. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure how I feel about the ratio of, like, old stages to new stages, at least regarding the, uh, the launch lineup so far. Like, I've been playing a lot of Splatoon 2 stages, uh, more than I'd like to. Considering, you know, it is a new game, and I'm here to play on the new ones. Um, but what, I, what I've seen, I've enjoyed, and uh, I think this might be the first lineup we've seen. Uh, in the stream so far that, that have all actually been just like no frills the new stuff so this is gonna be a good night bro are you serious right now man the damage on those those uh crap shots if you're not using the bombs is, is not very great though dude this guy thinks he's doing something yeah I remember um the Splattershot Pro, specifically being really good on Arowana Mall. 
I remember using it there a lot, because there's like a lot of like long, narrow corridors, and so the the range, the damage, the rate of fire, all suited very well to that geometry. Oh, the booyah bomb. Can I go up here? Or is this like a like a Meaver's post? <laughs> I couldn't really tell. They're pushing back hard. Donut Lord? Like from the Sonic the Hedgehog movie. Oh boy. Alright, how does that shake out? What are we looking at here? 53.1. See, there. I really feel like there's like an observable difference when I'm wielding this though. I think it'd be really cool if, um... Splatoon 3 gave you the same, the same level of analytics as, like, ARMS did. ARMS had, like, a lot of data to look at that, like... Like, over time, like, oh, here's, like, what your stats were in this version of the game, and then, like, you look at it a year later, and, like, oh, this is how your performance was at this point in time. And I think it'd be cool to be able to just have this, like, direct correlation of, like, oh, well, this is your average numbers with this weapon. I don't know though, I remember in Splatnet 2, they did like to, to bury some form of, of analytic stuff to mess around with. I don't know if that's in Splatnet 3, but I'll have to to take a closer look at that. So far I've only ever been like doing it to um like order the clothes. And then it always tells me that I've already ordered something from like the day one that I had it. So I don't know. I don't know what I'm missing here. That it that it like won't give me my shipment. I guess I just have to wait still. I could have sworn you would have gotten it, like, in the first, like, one to three days, though. So I don't know, like, what's left. So I have to, like, wait, like, a week for an order? Because that's, like, a lot to commit to. To, like, pass up all the items that are going to come on the successive days, you know? Like, there's always going to be something better that comes along, but it only lets you order one at a time, and it takes so long. So you have to, like, be giving up other gear to do it. That was really good traffic cone physics. I don't think I heard this music! What is this? The cowbell?! No, I've been on this stage. I remember the diagonal bridge. Okay. So not like brand new new, but still like original to three style stages. Shit, someone's behind me. Erm, um, they're right behind me, aren't they? Man, I really should vote for a team already. How are you guys voting in the Splatfest? Let's take a, a, a quick survey of chat here. What's uh, what's the Splatfest standings looking like so far? If you had to choose, what is it, gear, grub, or fun? I am leaning towards Big Man, as always, but uh, I don't like that he thinks that the card game is like, that's his idea of fun, you know? Jeez. The gear you ordered comes immediately, you gotta talk to merch. Wait, what? Oh! I thought it like appears in like a like a cardboard box as soon as you like load up the game. Wait, what is this? Like, okay, so now I have this. What does it do? What does that do? I do not know what that secondary does. I would be gear. Man, uh, that's a problem. If that's the secondary, if the Splattershot Pro comes with that shit, I might have to give it up. I mean, or I could simply find out how to use it, but, uh, it's a little unusual, isn't it? What do you say? Oh my god. No, no, that's like reward stuff? Oh, jeez. 26 seconds. And I'm the last one standing! I'm gonna hit this guy with this. Like, what does it do? No, we're fucked. We're fucked on this match. It's all over. I 
How come they're already this deep? I don't have any ice cream on my team. It's supposed to help me do better. Can't vor, sorry. Can't vote either. Yeah, you don't have to have the game. I'm just saying that, like, what's, what's, what's your opinion, right? What's your input on the situation? If you had it, what would it be? Robin's Grub Gang? Hmm. I'll keep going. Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter in, like, the immediate next two hours, but... So what is- what is this? It, like, makes, like, a, like a zigzag shape. You can, like, throw it multiple times. It uses ink. Here's what I'll do. I'll, I'll turn on the copy machine. And I'll, like, do it at myself. Oh, but... Okay, so it was making sounds as though it, like, damaged it. But, uh, that thing only throws the one kind of bomb. So that's... No, I don't like that. I really don't like that. It marks anybody who passes through the line. Oh, it just marks them? No, that's stupid. I'm gonna find myself a different loadout. Like a Splattershot Pro that comes with something else. That's what- that's what's gonna kill it for me. Like, the main weapon is good. Uh, it needs something else. Oh, wait! Does the ink you shoot into the vacuum get, like, blasted back out at you? So, like, the more it gobbles up, the more damage it does? There's an interesting idea. Give me, like, a splatter shot part with one of those, I don't know. Oh god, I was worried it was gonna, like, slide, like, backwards into the water there. I don't know why we're booyahing, but, you know. What? Oh my god! It was, like, like a, like a ten-second walk from here to there? And we're already, like, fully oranged up. What's Big Man's choice? Big Man chose, uh, fun. He said he would bring the card game to the island. My jeez! How are there, like, perpetually, like, two to three people any route that I try to go? What's up with that? Hold on, wait a second. Doesn't that guy have dualies? No, I'm looking at the top screen. They don't have nobody has, on that team has dualies. Moving awfully fast either way though. What took place here? Ow! Okay, no fun then. Yeah, it is, uh, it is interesting that there's not necessarily a clear favorite this time around. Uh, I, I was saying earlier that, uh, compared to Cali Marie and compared to Perla Marina, the Deep Cut is, like, the best ensemble that this series has seen before. And, uh, as much as I like Big Man, I don't know if there's necessarily, like, a, like a, oh, I have to pick whatever this character picks. Like, I could go along with, with any of the three characters' votes and, like, not... <laughs> Like, I have to feel bad about it. I would choose Grub. Yeah, I've been seeing in my own, like, personal circles. Definitely, like, a lot of Grub lovers. Jeez, finally! I've been having a really hard time getting any KOs in. And, of course, gets undone just as quickly as I achieved anything. Wow, that felt awful. They 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 pushed back on us really really hard. Oh my god! Look at that. But here's another important question: uh, because I didn't participate in the world premiere Splatfest, 
Uh, let's see. That that one was it was like red, yellow, blue. It was rock, paper, scissors. Uh, which team won that? Because I may already have to choose like the big guy to like start rooting against from now on, you know. Gearheads will post full paragraphs of rationale, so basically, they're nerds. I just want a burger. Mm. I don't know, like, Shiver's kind of got a point, though, that you can, like, use gear to make the other two things. You could use gear to make fun. If you had gear, you could, like... I don't know, like chop a tree and then like make little cards if you wanted. I think it's a, a waste of resources, but you know. You'd have the choice. Big Man wouldn't have the choice. He would see a tree and it would all only ever be able to be a tree. If you lose the cards, you can't like make new ones. Team Scissors won that one. Okay, so so which character picked scissors? Which of these three innocent characters do I hate now? These innocent souls. Shiver did? Hmm. She was kind of mean with that shark. What was up with that? Oh god, now I have to go against Robin? <laughs> I'm literally pressing B! To try and do the dually dodge. I still I still have the instinct in me. I still have the instinct. Who's Ouchin, dude? Oh, the shield! Man, that's really cheeky. Uh, I remember when, when Smash Bros. Brawl first came out, uh, and they had that, like, Gardevoir ability, where there's, like, the shield that protects you. For the longest time, I'm like, dude, how do you do it? How do you get past it? How do you beat it? I don't get it. Uh, and apparently, this same lack of understanding transfers over to Splatoon 3. I haven't learned, I haven't learned a single thing since then. See ya, eight. Very strange water in this one. Jeez! Oh my, there's so many! That is more than 5.1. Wait, Robin used a 5.1 on me? That's not, that's not fair. That's a little, you know, we're like buddies, aren't we? We're, we're supposed to be. Oh god. Uh, but yeah, uh, Mahi Mahi Resort has like really nice looking water, but the water here looks like very like, Murky. It looks it looks milky. The football milk. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta get a move on here. Left stop. Robin, can you like stop bullying me? You are nothing but a big bully. I know what you are. Fuck! Even with the Splattershot Pro, the one thing that I was saying that it was good at is the offensive capabilities. And I am, like, doing much better than I ever did with the Duelies. Despite it all, I still can't get a single kill in on Robin. That's just the way it goes. Like, I can barely take a, a step out my front door here. Nice to have this, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. I honestly we can skip the Judd one, you know? There were no survivors from that. Like, that's like an 80% lead. That is ridiculous. <laughs> Processed president? I'm glad that uh as as more time is is passing, 
in the lifetime of Splatoon 3, you know. Uh, I've been talking about how it's going to take a really long time to get any gear or uh, personalization items that are really worthwhile. Um, however, you can already observe that this is happening to other people, that other people are spending the time that's required. Oh shit, Ryan's in here! Kind of cool. Wait, I can like... I can bully the copy machine without even like turning it on? Feels like a bit of an unfair fight. Okay, so that means then that I, that I really need to train- look at this. I'm not even gonna practice on the dummies, I'm gonna practice shooting the real thing. She thinks that she can dodge my abilities. She's dead wrong. That third time, you were literally coming for me. The other two times, though, I did go on the hunt. <laughs> Not my fault. I have an insatiable need to kill a heartbreak. Where'd you go? That wasn't like 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 a like a squid submerged. By the way, she just like kind of clipped through the ground. the The projector machine's a little like on the fritz today. All right. I'm ready to take another crack at this. I'm ready to have, like, Griffin's big comeback. You know, I, I, it's been not a great night. It's been not a great couple of years, but tonight it all changes. I've got Ryan on my side. It all changes. Oh. But not with the help of this thing. See, what I thought it was at first is maybe, like, you can summon an ink rail, like I could just go zip, boom, and then I can like go in squid mode and then like ride the rail up. Uh, that'd be an amazing sub weapon, uh, and it's kind of stupid that it's not a thing. And then like maybe like your your teammates could use it, but then like the enemies could like shoot it and then like it could drop you if you're still like actively on it. I guess the closest thing to that is kind of like that uh the zip line thing that they already have. Um, but the problem with that is that like it teleports you backwards once you're done with it, so it's not like a, a viable movement option to get to places that you want to be. Because once the timer expires, it undoes all your hard work, right? I don't know how I feel about such matters. I eat playing cards. Cool. Good to know. Oh, we've got a snack machine! I don't know if going backwards, if retreating to get it is, is a good idea, though. Maybe if, like, I die, then I'll pick it up on the next pass, but... I've got to actively drive back... My own friends! My alleged friends, my supposed friends. My so-called friends. Am I getting sniped on? No, I'm getting, like, honed in on, I guess. Maybe, like, cross some sort of tripwire? The thingy that I've got, you know? Okay, we gotta push further in. This guy fell off the bridge. Damn, kinda fell off. That's right. You better leave me alone, that's what I thought. I've got no out though, yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably turning around and exposing my back to this guy was also, like, not a good idea. If I had to, like, review the process there. Alright, so is the vending machine still there? Can I... Well, it is now! I can acquire a, a latent snake. Yippee! Man, that's a great secondary, though. I'm in love with that thing. Oh god, it's the bounty bitch! Damn, never mind Robin, this all turn in Monarch. Is wiping the floor with me tonight. Can I go through this? No, that's like a... It's chain link, but there's like a layer of glass over top of it, so... It teases... With something that cannot happen. Wait, do we actually win? What? But it looks so much like a win! Like, eyeballing that, that looks substantially more blue 
Then it does this fluorescent yellow green. What changed? You know, speaking of arms, it is a little funny that, um... Like, the palette that they're using to represent Splatoon 3. You know, not the, the blue that I have on right now. But, um... Like, the blue and yellow Joy-Cons, the, the shade of yellow that they're using are the exact same ones from ARMS. And they just have, like, a warehouse full of them. Nobody bought ARMS. Like, alright, guys, what are we gonna do with these? It's like, they throw out all the left ones. And they're like, alright, we have these right ones now. And, and then they just, like, they pretend like it's always been Splatoon 3's thing. Like, ARMS never happened. I remember. They can try to make me forget, but I won't. Wait, you can, like, make shapes in this. I don't know what shape I'm trying to make right now. I don't know, like, like, like a fucking yield sign? I'm really passionate about traffic safety. Having to put arms on my games that fell off list made me so sad. Nobody forced you to do it. Um, however, I am forced to make lists. Uh, I made three of them on Backlogs today, and when I told Max about it, they hated every single one of them. They didn't like a single one of the lists. And like, they, they, not even just like, oh, well I disagree with, like, they actually got like mad at me about it, like, on call. It is fun though. It's a it's a fun exercise to try and like think of a category to come up with in the first place and then like work backwards from that. Although I'm not sure how you would do it any other way. <laughs> it's not really a way to work forwards to decide what the theme of the list is at the very end. Although that on its own could be interesting. You just like lay out a bunch of games at completely random. And then you have to, like, figure out after the fact what it is that they have in common. <laughs> oh my god. There's no refuge! We gotta put a stop to this. Look at all this orange. You guys remember also when arms happened? Uh, that they announced these little like... I think they're like these things that you like slide onto the Joy-Con rails and then you stick AA batteries in them and they like extend the battery life of the Joy-Con. These things already last 20 hours on a single charge. I haven't charged them in three days and before we started the stream, I went to, like, the battery screen, and they still, like, had the bar filled all the way. Has anybody actually gotten those? Do they even still sell those? Stop! This is supposed to be Griffin's big comeback! Look at this. They even took our fucking ink rails! What is left? If I can't have anything else, I'll, I'll, I'll take the middle, I guess. I don't know. Look at this. This is gonna be pathetic. Hey, you know what? I actually carved out a, a pretty solid chunk once I managed to get around that that absolute onslaught, that absolute embarrassment that we are subjected to. <sighs> I 
I simply have to state the truth, and the truth is ARMS is dead dead. Even Nintendo wants to pretend it doesn't exist anymore. I mean, they put it in Smash. They didn't put Paper Mario on that shit. This is a good exercise. The Squid Precision. It's like Hopscotch, I guess. Wait, hold on. That's huge. Squid Hopscotch? Alright, check this out. Flawless. Backwards? No! It's all about the simple things. They amputated that shit. God damn it. Are they gonna have to amputate? Not to worry, honey. I'm in charge. That's cold. Okay, we, we gotta we gotta fix this. We gotta rehop my scotch. Dude, they unhopped my scotch. It's really hard to make like tiny zones to get into. Like even like one shot off of this thing takes up like so much physical space. Dude, hopscotch onto the wall? That's gonna go crazy. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Check this out. Can I do this? Do this, and this, and do this, and watch this, then I do this. Oh! When the squids go into the ink, they're still on the surface, right? Yeah! I mean, oh god. It's, uh, the squids don't have bones. So they just like melt into squid form. They become like a liquid. You see, like they. I I always imagined that they just get like really flat, right? That's how I see it. Like they're able to diffuse into their own ink. Holy shit! What YouTube poop was that from? I haven't thought about it in years. Uh, I believe that's from Arthur's massive throbbing hit. Uh, I want to say it's a walrus guy one. I told you not to touch it! I'm gonna start saying shit like this in ranked. I'm gonna, like, be playing against Robin and, like, fucking tower control. <laughs> no, I'm not, though. <laughs> I, really, I really can't. Arthur Timothy Reed! Ooh, I like these colors. Oh, I'm on the, the receiving end of the Verge redesign. I've always been pink when, when it's been this uh, palette combination. Guys, I'm, I'm really... I talked about this the other day. I'm still not over that. Man, fuck the story stream! I hate Web 3.0! Your ass is not playing ranked against me. I don't know. I, I carried over my ranking from, uh... Not the first game. The first, second game. And I believe there is one category of ranked mode activity that, if not S, I was A in. There was one that I got, like, okay at. And then, like, put it down, because, you know, why... Once you reach that point, it's like, alright, well... Any further investment in this will only, like, offer me something to lose instead of something to gain. I mean, there, there is, like, you know, rank X and all that, but, you know, I mean something that I can, like, reasonably strive for. I, I'm knowing my limits, and I'm playing within them. What if I just decided to get, like, really good at camp Clam Blitz? And I would keep saying to my friends, like, Oh, come on, guys, you wanna play Clam Blitz with me? 
and I'd have to have like such a hard time convincing my friends to play Clam Blitz with me. But because I'm like the only person who does, they like wind up getting like up to X rank in it. See ya, Aaron. Sorry, Griffin, I already got to A plus in this game. I do mean literally that we would not match against each other. See, but that's the thing, is that I think I, I think I have an A in one of the categories. So maybe, maybe there's something we could share. Yeah, snipe this. Snipe this. Snipe this, huh? Man, I don't know if it even necessarily feels good to be, like, doing what was done to us before, though, either. Like, I was talking about this... Like, Hagelfish Market, we get driven back right up against the wall. Um, quite a fair bunch. And they go, oh, it's not fun when this is done to you. But even, like, when you're doing it to them, there's still, like, a certain, like, sickness. I feel like I shouldn't be doing this. Um, although it seems like this moment of hesitation that, that urged me to retreat and give them, like, a fighting chance, uh, may have single-handedly been, like, the reason we lost. So, I guess that's why we don't have Mercy in Splatoon. But it is why we have Mercy in Overwatch. I would play Clam Blitz with you? No, you wouldn't. I wouldn't! Bitch, I wouldn't play Clam Blitz with me! Are you kidding, dude? Yeah, uh, I'm, like, still not clear on how the stuff that gets ported over from 2 to 3 specifically works, um, but I do know that it does, like, affect your, like, rank. Like, you're not starting from, like, the C- minus or whatever the, the minimum one is, so I have somewhat of a foot in the door, um, but it really depends on the mode, like I said. I should be able to, like, check up on it, like, right now, though, yeah? If I go, like, back in here and I can just, like, see. Oh! I guess I can't. <gasps> oh, God. Wait a second. If the old music is, is in the lobby here, does that mean that we're gonna get, like, a fiddle jump scare at, at some point or another? Feral Table Turf Battler! <laughs> Oh god. Yeah, if you were above B minus in two, you just get put back there. Oh, so everybody starts at B minus? Like even though if I was like rank X in Splatoon 3 it would put me in B minus. They couldn't have gone far. One more player see. Aw, oh, man! Uh, okay then. Sure. It'd be nice if I could, like, dismiss the menu and then just, like, leave. But that shit, like... Really loves to stay on your screen for, like, a ten full seconds. No contest! Yeah, it made the first week of ranked real rough, but now people are getting back to where they should be. Okay, so actually, I'm really smart for waiting. Ah, <gasps> it's Roach Gore. You know, how come they don't make orange and blue Joy-Con? Because they, like, they made orange ones that they mixed with, uh, with purple. But they haven't, like, reused it for, like, any other color combinations. That one would look so much nicer, in my opinion. I really think the orange and purple is some of the ugliest shit they've ever had, like, the the gall to put out. But, you know, if they can reuse the orange ones, then why not? 
Or rather, if they can reuse the arms ones, then why not reuse the orange? Tide Pod Joy-Cons! <laughs> Kids will eat them. I'm saying this because it's like a- like this- the classic Splatoon 1 palette. But people calling them Tide Pod Joy-Cons would actually be a good thing, because then that would mean that kids would want them. And they would sell well. Nice. You know what? Yeah, this is a bit of a booyah moment. I love playing with my friends. Assuming that we don't get another stupid fucking connection error again. Yeah, I think out of the two that are in rotation, um, maybe there's time for me to, like, get better at Hagglefish Market. Or maybe, like, the reasons I wasn't having a good time on that stage or for, like, other circumstances besides the stage itself. Um, but I just kind of, like, lose there a lot right now. And I want to get away from it. Here I, like, I have a better, like, firmer understanding of how to win on it. Um, the width of Hagelfish Market is nice in theory. Um, really hard to actually do much about once you're actually, like, in it. Gamer Kitty. Whoa! Oh, it's Gamer Kitty. Wait, who else is here? Who else is here? Oh! Oh! Oh, it's Roachgor. Shit, roachgor has got the dualies now? That's funny. It, you know, it was literally... Roach was the one with the Splattershot Pro the other night that, like, reminded me, like, Oh, yeah, that weapon. I should, like, give that a shot, shouldn't I? And now he's, like, slotted right back into to where I used to be. Maybe, like, if you want to keep the bit going, you can also start, like, losing a lot. You can, like, start being really bad. Um, right up until the point that is you're back on my team, and then, and then you the bit, and then the next bit, right? I really love the, um, like, the animation smearing effect on that Splatana, though. Although that could just literally be the ink, like, swinging off a bit. Uh, really pretty in motion either way. God, how come you can win with the dualies? I can't do damage like that when I got the dualies. Shit, and they have like the what is that? What is that called? The reef slider or something like that? I don't have the reef slider. I have crap. Oh my god! I don't know if how much soda is it gonna take to dig us out of this mess? <laughs> Everyone is so fast. Squid jump. Oh, everyone's dead. I'll get this like little spot here. You know, the point zero one percent of the corner that nobody else bothered to to look at. Wow. Griffin jumping into a splat bomb, expecting inking it, will make it not kill him is really funny. I didn't even see the bomb! The bomb didn't have anything, like, anything to do with the situation. It was overwhelming for for other reasons. Cosmo, defeat Wanda. Oh, this is another classic, by the way. Are the trippy chirps still around? By the way, the I know the trippy chirps. The band name was like, I th I don't know if it's like a regional thing or if they have two names in all regions, but I, I think they also go by A B X Y. Why did you say that like the Jarvis guy? Cause, 
Because, Jackie, you say everything like the Jarvis guy. I thought that was, like, the voice that you were typing that in. God, every time I like, see, like, like, the background of apartment buildings, I, I, like... My heart flutters, and I think Flounder Heights. But I know it isn't, it isn't so. Well, it's good to know, then. Booyah. That it is actually not the fault of Hagelfish Market that I'm losing at the game. And, uh... I think this just always happens no matter what. I think it's just uh, the kind of person I am, perhaps. Maybe it was how I was raised as a kid, I don't know. I do not! Wow, I feel insulted. Jackie, what the fuck were you talking about? You were literally using Robert Downey Jr. emotes in my chat yesterday! I have the fucking, like, receipts, dude. They were in two, but now they're not in three because Harmony is just here now. Oh, is, is, is that the group that she was, like, formerly a part of? That's cool. Okay. Well, then I've always, like, secretly been a Harmony fan then. What a wonderful thing to learn about myself today. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. My periphery is way too blue right now. I see the game too trying to play. I'm out. I'm sick of them. Damn. Was that a mutual kill? No, that was Roach Gore. Because of fucking course it was. Yeah, you can hear her voice in the text box. It's exactly like the Trippy Trip singing voice. Cool. She was the lead, yeah. Wow. How come this isn't inked? God, I miss the Wii U gamepad. Oh my god! Roach really doesn't miss a beat. It's crazy. He's like everywhere all at once. Whoa, oh, oh, whoa! I didn't mean to! Thank you for saving me. Thank you for your noble sacrifice. Shit! Somebody killed Roachcore. Somebody saved me from Roachcore. And lived to tell the tale. Oh god. Man, someone's got a lot of those things to. Someone's got a There's so many! It's like four in a row! There's landmines? Just gotta focus on the task at hand. <sighs> wow. That one was really tense. Still not good enough, though. I only got two rewards this time? How the fuck am I the number one ink consumer? I guess maybe that means that I ran out of ink the most, like I bottomed out more times than anybody else did. I kind of did. I was hearing that kind of like a uh, empty trigger clicking quite a few times. What's going on in the, uh, the locker room today? I haven't been here yet. I'm just here to look at the exteriors for now though. I'm scared to, to open them up and look at the inside because I don't know what, what kind of rewards you get for beating the game. And there might be spoilers. Is this like a, like a gas pump? What is this? Yeah, I can only ever really see the lasers coming from the projectors to form the holograms when I'm in like this specific room. Out in the open, I don't really see them, see them as much, if at all. Okay, well now I'm playing with Roach and Ryan. So maybe this is my chance to prove that actually Hagelfish Market is a good stage. It's gonna take some legwork though. Hey, 
Hey, who already oranged up here? Nobody to worry about anymore, at least. Yeah, I really like this track, though, by the way. This one's a lot of fun. <gasps> the missiles! I gotta shield up! Wasn't enough. Dude, this isn't looking super inked, if you ask me. Bro, I think the fuck not. Aw, oh, man! I was really hoping that that was only going to, like, activate above the grate. And none of the ink would drip down. And so that way I could, like, fake out and then, like, kill them from beneath. That would have been such a cool, like, counter. Uh, it didn't really shake out that way, though, did it? Even with the, sh the Splattershot Pro, it takes that many hits, huh? Or oh, god forbid there are other factors at play. Oh, that's right, this is still useless though. Man, I really might switch off of these. Jeez. Oh, they might have taken full control of the middle. They might have just barely pushed themselves over the finish line at the last second there. Yeah. If we, like, still held control of that, if the match ended, like, a few seconds earlier... No, he still did it! Look at that! I guess the sides were enough to get us through still. Phew. But is the stage good? Still hard to say. Still hard to come to a conclusion on this. The number one super jump spot. How come I'm getting no medals anymore? <gasps> a new ability, though. Maybe this is why I suck shit. Because I got, like, new clothes. Because my, my former gear was already, like, filled up. It already was, like, nice and chunky. <gasps> it's Katie Rose! Awesome. Where is she? I want to go say hi. Drawing circles. Um, I can't draw circles, but I can, like, swim in one. I can swim in a circle. Yippee! I love the, the subsurface, like, normal map bumps that you can make in that. See the, the, the spiral shape that I'm kind of, like, squelching into the ink? I was almost done! Hi, bestie. Hi, Katie. Next time, I'll, I'll go all in on my shape. And it will be so cool. Shit. But you you and I are going to have to go up against Robin and Roachgore? I don't know. Oh my god, we've got the- we've got the fucking Fire Emblem Engage palette! Look at this! This is about as, like, as red as it gets. Oh, I guess not, though. These guys are, are like, still, like, teal. It's only, like, the... 
what would you call it? The, the tertiary color? Hit that shade of blue. Because that's the thing that nobody talks about when it comes to Splatoon palettes, is that things like uh, those dividers also like change colors based on the the primary palette that's involved. I wonder how they're going to manage that with things like the tricolor splat vests. Because then they'll have to come up with like like a fourth color that complements it. Whoa! I'm a, I'm a little concerned about the status of the situation. Oh, this is nice looking water, though. This is a good, like, lake water. All, all the whipples. The whipples from the wind! The ripples from the wind! Look very nice. You know, like, I'm already losing, too. Like, I, by, by admiring something for a few seconds, like, at this point, what difference is it gonna make? Like, really? I'm gonna be honest, that water looks awful. Bro, have you ever been to, like, a lake? It looks good! That's exactly what it looks like. 3 FPS looking ass. It's animating just fine. But I'm also playing this game at, like, a... Not at 60. So maybe if I if I did, I'd be able to, to see if that was, like, actually a thing. I can't imagine it would be, though. It makes sense that they would do that on things like, like, NPCs. But water would kind of be pushing it a little far, maybe. Ahim, him, whipple. <laughs> Stop. Bro, I need a fucking secondary already, okay? See, this is my big trick, though. Because I was able to lure Robin all the way back to her side of the stage, and now she has to, like, go all the way back if she wants to go back to bullying us. Will she be able to do it in time? Personally, I doubt it. Dude, I don't think I charged my special up a single time. Wait, wait, why would you not play at 60 and also that's not an option? I think Griffin isn't streaming at 60 on account of due to the internet. No, I... Uh, this is really funny. There, there are multiple layers of, of bad frame rate involved here. Number one is the local recording on my end, because uh, I think it's, like, my computer's fault, but uh, I cannot get, like, 60 FPS or, like, a high resolution or a high bit rate off my capture card, so I have to lower the settings as, like, low as they'll go. So I'm, I'm doing, like, 720-30 right now, um, and that's with screen tearing. Like, even that is, like, overwhelming to my computer. Um... Now, my internet is also bad, and it takes that input, and it makes that even worse. Um, which is only, like, a bad thing for the Twitch audience. Uh, for, the, for the local recordings that go up on the, the VOD channel, uh, those, those are still, like, even if the stream gets really lossy, those will be fine. Uh, not much to do about the screen tearing, aside from just upgrading my computer, though, I guess. Um... Oh Christ, I forgot you're playing through the capture card window. Awesome 0 0.8 seconds of delay. I've, li I've literally become like so strong and powerful because of it. Like, these are my gamer training weights. And I'm not joking. Oh wait, I was gonna draw, that's right. There we go, Katie Rose, it's a shape for you. It's even red. They aren't training weights if you never take them off. Well, see, this is what's gonna happen. This is what's gonna happen. When the time comes to move on to a computer that does have, like, a, like a proper... That can accept a normal-ass video signal. That doesn't, like, shit its pants and start crying.
Can I get out of this corner, please? There we go. <gasps> Katie Rose, the Reef Slider. You saved. Oh. Raihan Heart. Honestly, I kind of agree. Honestly, same. Griffin gaslighting himself into thinking it's okay. I mean, my problem, I haven't, I don't think the input delay is like that bad for me. Um, for me, it, it really is just like the video quality and the frame rate. And especially the screen tearing that bothers me the most. That's what I'd like to fix in the future. But like, if I upgraded to a new setup and I still had the input delay and everything else is improved, I would not complain. Computer that is also a monitor moment. No, 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 no. You guys don't. You don't understand! You're like literally making shit about my streaming setup. You don't even know what to use. Computer that is also a monitor moment? I literally have an external display hooked up, you fucking God! Fuck! I'm using two displays right now. I'm using a 2016 Touch Bar MacBook Pro with Retina display attached to a 2011 Thunderbolt Apple Cinema display. The capture card is going into the computer. Wait, is it? No, the ca yeah, the capture card goes into the computer, then the computer passes the signal to the monitor. In the monitor, I have the capture card stuff up on full screen, and then on OBS, I do a desktop recording of the preview of the, like, the Elgato capture, like, software. Like, if I move my mouse, it'll bring up a really ugly overlay. However, I will not be demonstrating this on account of it being ugly, and it's really annoying to dismiss. I've been over this a million fucking times! I would imagine my regulars would understand by now, like, the specific ways in which my setup sucks, sucks instead of, like, literally, like, like, making up reasons why it's bad. All I hear is that Apple owns you once again. Thunderbolt is an open standard! Literally, Intel invented it! It's not Apple! Two computers, two monitors, two devices in total. But Thunderbolt is better for literally everything else! Dude, I fucking hate HDMI. I really do. If that's a solution, I'll just grip and get an HDMI monitor. Fuck off. Dude. Integer I need the integer scaling, dude. I need my gigabits. I need my, my, my gigabytes per second. <sighs> Unfortunately, this rage did not translate into, into, into winning results. <laughs> Man, I wish I was playing with Raihan Heart Emoticon. I feel like we'd have a lot to talk about. I'm never gonna see that person again. I will say, though, uh, I definitely have been, like, window shopping for upgrades. Like, if I were to upgrade, what sort of things would I be poking up? And, uh, man, in, in 2016, I'm not gonna lie, the Macs have f fucking sucked. From, like, 2016, like, right up to, I want to say, like, 2020. But ever since they started doing those M1s, god, I'm salivating over some of the numbers you can you can pull out of that thing. Uh, especially when it comes to the the hardware accelerated video stuff, um, like that shit would just be like really good for work. <gasps> the crab, and it's not even a situation like oh it's like oh I, I like definitely want like a laptop like between that the Mac Studio, there's like a lot of like form factors and options that I could like choose. You mean windows shopping? No! Lucky there's an HDMI! Lucky there is a man who positively can't do all the things that make us. P T or Griffin! You know what though? This is a good opportunity. Uh my good friend Judd just reminded me about merch. Uh I'm gonna do some less than window shopping. Or is it more than window shopping? In my, in this here, Splatoon 3. Uh, I still don't have my cards. I still don't have my chunks. Actually, is Merch? Merch hangs out over here. I haven't spoken to Merch like a single time. Average fun haver. When I was like zoomed out, it looked like it said fucking. 
It looks like this is a fucking fun. Oi, chum. Going for full-fledged freshness, I see. Looking good, chum. But something tells me you've got sights set somewhere even fresher. That's got me thinking. Where are my sights set? Maybe you ought to be aiming higher, too. But all that boils down to is this. If you gotta be a big deal, then I wanna be that big deal's gear hookup. Skip those orders coming. If you're in the square checking out folks today, and you've got gear you want, I need to know. Oh, order status. Yes, I have. Oh, Splatnet delivery. Yeah. Yeah? Great, I got fucking boots. I literally- I already own it?! No. Great. So I've been sitting on that piece of gear for days, waiting it for it to, waiting for it to arrive in a cardboard box. It wasn't even worth it. But it does mean that, uh... Can you, like, yoink the amiibo gear? If you wanted to? How do you do this? How do you, you, like, click on them, right? Or does that only work if there's, like, a Splatfest post? Or a, a Miiverse post? Because I can click on you. And, it, yeah, I can order gear from this person. Now, Bluebeam? There's nothing cringe about inking the enemy base. But, Dad, the enemies are coming. Wait, so I can, like, inspect Katie Rose, and I can order this gear. Oh. No, you can order. Okay. Well, there we go. Hmm. Man, because there was that really good hoodie that I saw a little while back. That's what I'm really here for. This is what I want the most. So dearly. Amiibo gear is unyoinkable. Kids these days don't booyah back. Gear will win. <gasps> it's Callie! Yippee! Thank you, Lamb Chop. You know what? Yeah. This is pretty homosexual energy. I'll give that a fresh. Let's have fun! This dude looks like he runs a YouTube channel reviewing X-Men movies and Sega Mega Drive games. <laughs> I love food. Guys, what if I just like sat here for like a, like a full hour drawing out another post? Team Gear be like <laughs> God damn it. What was that what was that like salmon that I made like direct eye contact with for a split second? Who was that? Where did that come from? Was that gear or was that like a person? Oh dude. I can see what I need right now. There's pink here. I'll get one of these. And I'll get one of these, the pink and the black. The XO one deco? Oh, dude. The Angies. Awesome. And apparently I own zero cardboard boxes. I can get an eye ship it. That's cool. Uh, what else do we have here? What else is on the menu? Oh, still the, these shoes? Yeah, the... This is the same stuff that I bought yesterday. Did the gear not refresh? This stuff looks new. A fashion conundrum. Oh, no, I'm not gonna raise any star power. I don't care. Uh, cause the Zapfish satin jacket? That looks beautiful. What is this? Khaki Ranger vest? I don't know about that. I'm still looking for some, like, headgear that, like, really speaks to me, though. Yeah, they're all explaining the same thing to me. Uh, the squid beak shield? What does that look like? What the fuck? No, I'm not wearing that. Oh, no, 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 no! Alright, 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 alright. So when's the next splatter shot though? Is there another splatter shot that's that I'm coming in on? Let me see here. Yeah, ha let me see how high this even like goes up to here. Cause there's a there's all sorts of levels to be working your way up to. No, there's no other splatter shot. I guess it's gonna come in like later updates then. Have you used any conch shells yet? They're so good. I don't know if I have any, if I've like acquired them. Oh, like Metal Gear. I get it. That's cute. 
There's the gacha, but it's awesome to be able to roll more. Squidbeak shield is Griffin Core? What the hell does that mean? I literally chose not to buy it. I like these vertical posts, though. That's cute. I don't know why they get, like, re-rotated when you look at them, though. That's strange. Why? Sorry, what was that? What did I just mouse over? Grub! Jump! Literally, where did that come from? I was, like, mousing over some, like... Scary invisible target. Was this the, the, the green thing up there? Yeah, okay. It's cool in like the, the green and pink palette of all these posts because I just came out of like a like a green match. That's cool. Wait, hi Fry. Wow, someone had to like do the work of, of dithering all those pixels. I really admire that. You know, I'm okay not knowing about every little thing. Because sometimes this game has like stupid systems that I think uh, are not worth my time. I just want to play the game instead. Let me, uh... Let me pop in... Series open. One extreme battle. Win five in triumph. Lose three and you're out. We're doing splat zones right now, between Mincemeat Metalworks and Mahi Mahi Resort. Well, these are stages that I'm already familiar with, so it's, I'm not, like, accessing any extra new stuff. I still have never done Hammerhead Bridge beyond just, like, that, that one initial match. <sighs> Fuck it, I'll do splat zones. I'll spend the pee. I'll do whatever it takes. I'm doing splat zones. I have crawled away from ranked mode, my tail between my legs. For years and years, I, every time somebody asks, like, oh, Griffin, you know, they, they talk to me about playing ranked mode, I always say, no, ranked sucks, and it's not fun, and I hate it. Turf war forever. This is what I say. Um, and I do still believe this, but this is a brand new game, this is a brand new chance. Sadly, it's not a brand new rank, I kind of wish it was, because B- minus is really going to be throwing me in the deep end here. Um... But, like, fuck it, why not? I'm ready to drown, who's asking? Very brave to play with an extra second of reaction time. It's really not an extra second. Let's see what it is. Jump. 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 Now, I will clarify that, uh... <laughs> when I first got all my, uh, my, my streaming equipment... Uh, the first game that I was going to stream was Xenoblade Chronicles 2. I was going to do my, my blind playthrough of that. Um, with the HD 60S. But then I realized that I didn't have the HD 60S. It's the, it's the HD 60. Uh, and that has like a full second, if not more, of input delay. So I had to like send it back and then like get a new, uh, the, the right one. Oh wait, this is ranked! That's right. I have to like play differently from now on. Okay, well we're already winning, right? Assuming there's only the one splat zone. Jump! Jump! Oh no, it's sinking! Oh no, we're sinking! You have got to play Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Yeah, uh, that, that video started going around again a lot when uh, the Pikmin 4 news dropped. That, uh, that YouTube poop that I made. The, the full quote, by the way, though, that he says in that cameo is a... Uh, is very he just like goes on like like a rant about the Xenoblade Chronicles series about how he doesn't like it, and this is in response to somebody who like paid him to talk about Xenoblade Chronicles to say you have got to play Xenoblade like he says the thing that like he was asked to say for like the first ten seconds and like the next two minutes just like another like stupid fucking rambling Arlo video and this dude like is, aren't cameos like paid by the minute like he's literally like talking shit 
on this thing that somebody like asked. Like on their dollar, on their dime. And then he says shit like, people are like literally mad at me because they don't like Xenoblade Chronicles. Uh, which is why I have that ever so famous Walter White image, which uh, you know I'd love to pull up right now, but I don't think in the heat of a ranked battle is uh, the best time to whip it out. But uh, you know, I'm always ready. To, to bring up my Arlo memes if, if it is necessary. Uh, did the match already end? Did I already win a ranked battle? Shit, I'll go get that Walter White then. They should have known what they were getting into. Wow, we did win! Okay. Walt, Wall, Arlo. No, this is this is like one version that I have of it. Uh, and then this is the second version. This, this is what he says verbatim. He says, I'm not a big Xenoblade fan. Um, uh, lots of people get on my- People are, like, mad at me. There are literally people that are, like, ma angry at me for not playing Xenoblade. I don't know, it's just not my thing. Arlo loves to make qualitative statements about games that he refuses to play. Yeah, I'll stick with this team. Why not? Fuck Pikmin 4. I need that paper! Oh, I get to hang out with in the lobby. With my new friends. With my new friends who help me win instead of hurt me. I'm making cry. <sighs> Damn it! I want you to know, by the way, that from now on I'm calling this game Slop Scotch. You have to do it without, like, touching the ground, is the trick. That's how you win. See, that's really hard to do. Maybe I should do, like a, like, a squid surge? There we go! Nice, fat plunk. That's how you do it. Now, now I gotta do it in reverse. And the squid surge is gonna come in really handy here. Oh! Battle time! Hey, baby! I can get that bank account out of the red and into the blue! Do you think Arlo goes on Wall Street bets? Do you think Arlo- Do you think Arlo, like... What if he, like, lost all of his money and became destitute? <laughs> like, not like the person! Not- not Jiggy Thermos, just like the puppet? Like the guy in Wind Waker? He like spots you, he like starts approaching, he's like, oh god, I'm gonna get out of here. It's like the the Captain Sparkles Fallen Kingdom music video. He tries to get them every day to get them to buy mass stock of Nintendo. Wasn't there like that one guy who like bought a ton of shares in Nintendo so that they would earn? I'm sorry, I've been like inking completely random turf and not like at all doing the splat zone. Maybe of interest to me. But there was a guy who bought like $10,000 of shares, so that you could ask Nintendo, like, when is the next F-Zero game coming? Um, I feel like if Arlo could, he definitely, like, would. Damn right they're in control, we've got a problem here. Whoa, 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 that was close! Yeah, we gotta- we gotta claw this back already. Enough is enough, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Damn. Yeah, I got a squid jump too. Squid jumping comes in handy. Yeah. Dear Mr. Nintendo, when is the next Paper Mario? Uh... I'm sorry to tell you so, but... 
I've got good news. There actually is Paper Mario. No, I mean Paper Mario made specifically for me! And then he, like, he opens up his puppet mouth and he, like, there's, like, teeth in there and he starts, like, biting them. And he, like, he, he, like, won't, like, like, it's impossible to, like, get him to unlatch. He's, like, a fucking pit bull. This ink has the palette of Kraft Mac and Cheese. Wait, why are you like- why is that so true? Like, the other orange and blue that I was talking about was not quite like- Like, the, this is like a yellowier orange. This is a cheesier orange, I would say. Make Bug Fables 2 or you're going bankrupt! We're wiped out? 17 seconds. I don't like the look of this. But I have to win! There are stakes at play. Damn. It's over just like that. Okay, um... Well, I definitely have plans, strategies, things to learn from in terms of, uh, you know what I mean? Because so much of my, my Splatoon strategizing is always, like, catered towards, okay, well, what what's what works best in a Turf War situation? And this is not that. But I was in the number one Turf Inker. Oh, God. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna, like, lose all my lives. But at least it'll be, like a, like, like, a short number of matches before, um... Either I'm dead forever, or I win forever. And then that'll be, like, our opportunity to move on to the story mode. I don't know. We'll see. Hi, Funfetti. You and I, we gotta stick together. Assuming we're, like, the two people who are, like, actually good on the team. I don't know who's been, like, mostly pulling the weight so far, but I can't imagine it's been me. Look at this thing jiggle. Look at, like, the, the, this, like, very slight material on it. We were talking about things that, like, fe must feel like an agenda to run your hand over. I think this would feel like that, too. All these, like, kind of tiny little dots on it. It's tricky to point out because the dithering effect, when you get too close, is also made up of a bunch of tiny little dots. It's like, those tiny dot tiny little dots? No, not those ones. Different ones. Of course, it'll, it can always just come down to the map again. We did great on Mahi Mahi the first time around. Okay, nobody's taken it yet. YET, that is! Until right now, baby! Shit, out of ink. Come on. Shh, that would've been such a good KO if I didn't run out of ink! Come on, man. Wow, I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. Just, like, losing all of my ink right off the bat. Or, uh, losing the crab tank without dying. Like, Usually, when the crab tank takes enough damage, it just, like, kind of go down with the ship. Like, it just die instantly. Uh, that time, it just, like, deactivated. Like, left me to, to fend for myself. Uh, it was very unusual, actually. Water level dropping. Oh, God. Here we go. Man, we've got a pretty good lead on us still. That's right, baby. That's right. 
want to like kind of get in close and do something about this sniper. Oh, I guess they had their special out. What we need is a wipeout. What we need is carnage and violence and bloodshed. Is there Quika in this? I hear Quika. I get a faint whiff, I get faint notes of Quika. Ah, oh, just as I got to crab, dude! We gotta close this gap already. There is the wipeout! Fuck yes! Oh, dude, it, it's one thing in Turf War. But for that to happen, in ranked, in splat zones, that's awesome. I think we've lost control. I guess they went around me. ANOTHER WIPEOUT! Oh my booyah. You've got the lead, dude! Okay, we've gotta keep it up, we've gotta keep it up. Nice. Oh yeah, look at that lead. We're doing a great job right now. It's like going down fast too. That is not like a second at a time. That's like really, really rapid. Seven, six. Fuck! Fuck! Griffin, your zone. I don't know. I'm just trying to like... I think it's occasionally helpful... To, to do activities that will, like, fill the special meter faster, because then you can, like, hit them with that. If you're only focusing on the zone, then it'll, like, charge slower. So it's, it's sort of a, a trade-off, I guess, that I'm trying to make here. Shit, dude. Hi. Hi, growing rookie. Okay, we got a squid jump. They need me. They need my offensive capabilities here. Lest we be wiped out. Some high ground here, why not? Okay, good, good, good. Come on, we're close to taking it back. Nice! Come on, give me the double, give me the double, give me the double. Come on, two, 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 two! Nice, two! Ah, oh, but the shockwave got me! Little Cheese 2 fucking killed me! <laughs> Covering enemy ink on the ink zone also builds the special- Yeah, but like, slower. It's like, more hotly contested. It's like a- like a safer way to- to build up the special, right? Like, if you've already got it, then why not do like, unrelated ground to save yourself the time? Did we just win? Is that what that is? Is, 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 is this really meant to understand? Yeah, Mahi Mahi splat zones I can get into. Now, Tain I can get into. Why does it only count for 500p, though? Oh, dude, the guy who's got, like, the... the fluorescent eyes that match, like, the yellow jacket? That's cool. That's a fresh design. That's a really, really good outfit. Number one, Splat Decision. Number one, Crab Tank User. Number two, Splat Zone Inker. See, I'm still, like, the number two Inker. That's not so bad. Despite it all, I'm still inking. Okay, okay, okay. And all this, by the way, I'm managing with no secondary available to me. All I have is this dumb shit. This literally worthless, like, string. Is, is the smiley face supposed to have, like, fangs? Or is it supposed to be, like, like, pursing its lips? Like its upper lip is kind of like covering its bottom lip. <gasps> yeah, the angle shooter is so bad. Because you also get to avoid the huge penalty from them capturing. Hmm. It's a blobfish face. I see. Yeah, 
Now, this, on the other hand, I've yet to prove myself- How can we keep getting the fucking cheese pallet? I've yet to prove myself on this map. Shit. I thought it was, like, out of range enough for that to work. Now they got control. Damn. Does that mean that there is, like, such a thing as, like, being rewarded for, um... Like, letting them build up the initial splat zone as much as they want and, like, forcing them into a huge penalty? This is a, a viable strategy, perhaps? I keep thinking it blew on the walls like a Mimur's post, dude! Oh, sorry, Kestrelis. Probably's not gonna work out for you very good. <laughs> See, but now look, I've already got the crab ready to go, and I can just whip it out. Oh no! They got me like on the frame, dude. Okay, there we go. Let's fix this up. Shit. You know, I don't know so much about this strategy of mine. Might simply want to ink the zone. Like, I'm not the only one who's putting my shit on the line here. Everyone else is also, like, losing be because of this. We all lose together. And with only three possible losses. I can't imagine people are going to be very happy with that. Uh... Thank God I inked all of our home turf, though. That I that I inked our base. I'm sure that's really appreciated as we're uh, pounding our fists on the ground. I guess that's an interesting facet of Splatoon 3's like end of the battle uh, cycle, though, is that there actually aren't losing animations anymore. You know, everybody knows the moment where you got like the the bucket. And you like throw it up in the air and it like lands in your head and you get fucking beamed. I forgot I had this! Look at this, I forgot I had this. Probably would come in handy in um such a combat heavy game mode such as this. You need, like, a little bit of speed, though. You can't do it from a standstill. Or if you're, like, sliding to a stop too much. Yeah, we either have to win three more times, or just lose once. And, uh... I think if you guys know anything about the kind of person I am, uh... The outcome of this can likely be, uh, readily predicted. But we'll see. I think at like the very least I can I can eke out one more win, assuming we get Mahi Mahi. Oh no. But what if I can win? Okay, this is a good early lead. Look at that early lead. Yeah, I think inking the immediate ground isn't a bad idea. Like, the other teammates are doing it, too. I'm not totally in the wrong, uh, in the wrong, like, state of mind, you know. I've somewhat got the right idea. Oh, give me that fucking zone, baby. Whoa! That was too close. What do you mean they're in control? Like way to like go around and get them? No, not really. Unless you can hit the vehicles. No, you can't. Shit. Shit, they have crab tank too. Okay, let's go. I 
I'm gonna like er uh, ink some of the air ground. Cause that, that way when they die, it'll take like longer for them to get back home. No, they're already on the fucking like five, four, three, two, one, dude. Wow! Funfetti is with you for life. <laughs> We weren't able to take that shit back for the life of us! Not even like a, like a second. Not even an inch. They held onto that splat zone for grim death, is what they did. Wait, so does that mean that my, my, my rank drops down now? You gotta kill bitches. But look at all the number ones I got! I'm so helpful! Oh, I'm gonna go backwards. I'm gonna go backwards. Wait, no I'm not. I'm still- I still get to go up? I think... I guess when you do the five or when you do the three, it like, ranks up your average performance across that, and then it like, decides like, what to award you from that. So I thought it was like, all or nothing. Like, if you win five times, you go up a rank. If you lose three times, you go down a rank. But it seems that it's, um... I fucking hate Judd! The exclamation mark is supposed to be, oh, you have, like, coins to collect. Here, come collect your coins. You wouldn't want to leave your coins for nothing. But it gives you a tutorial. And it's, like, a persistent exclamation mark that's on screen at all times. And I go, like, oh, there's an exclamation mark. There's, like, it must mean something important. No, tell me, Judd! I already know, Judd! I fucking hate you! And I can't even do anything violent about it because they have a stupid fucking line! I'm doing this story mode. Not only, not only am I not doing any more battles, but I'm also exchanging my weapon for a not Splattershot Pro, because I'm sick of not having a secondary. Here I draw the line. Check the gotcha before you go, you can get funny titles. I, I already did my daily, Tyler. I already got the one that I need. It's getting me like like a 30,000 buy-in if I do it again. You're jealous of what? Judd? Oh, my catalog level went up, though. Where are the doolies? Give me back the doolies, dude. Look at the doolies squelchers. What do these have? Splat Bomb and Wave Breaker? I don't know if I'll use these, but I wouldn't mind owning them. Wait, where's the one that I have? Oh, it's over here? Owned? No, this is the one that I just, just bought. I think you have to go, like, all the way to the end of this, and then it shows you the stuff you own? Right, okay, I want to go back and do these. I think you already have that weapon. I'm trying to go... How do I re-equip my weapon? Do you not do it at a uh, ammo nights? Yeah, what was the there was like a like a thing that jump scared me when, when I was going into the store. I swear I saw like a like a flash of a uh, of a salmonid. Like not like a like a splatfest post either. I think it might have been like 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 a the top of this guy's head or something. Maybe it was like a hat of some kind. I don't know. I have to like rewatch the vod because I swear to God I saw like like a full screen salmonid like in my face, and I'm like I'm not making this up. I don't know what it was. It's gonna be really funny if I did like hallucinate this though. <laughs> oh, the equip screen. Uh, plus okay. But your conscience will go away when Splatfest starts. Hmm. Oh, you mean that I can spend the conscience at the gotcha instead of using money? See, but no, 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 no. Look in the top right corner. I, I don't have any. I don't have any conscience. Uh, I think I am going to have to to vote for the Splatfest, though. When does this take place? When does this take place? Hold on. You go, grow, I, I, I thought that said come. Yo, team come? Oh, it, it took away the date again. I gotta be, like, ready for it to, like, loop around. Let's see. When is it? Uh, from the 23rd to the 25th? 
I know I'm going to be around on the 26th. It's hard to say, actually. I guess we'll see. Oh, you can see, like, the back of the, the panel? That's cool. Oh, this is, like, the post that I accidentally summoned by zooming in on that. It's next weekend. I see. Uh, let me look at that one more time, because it shows you, like, the days of the week, not just, like, the number. Friday to Sunday? Ooh, hmm. It's hard to say. Hey, those are some cool sounds. Those are super sea snails, not conches. What the fuck do you mean super sea snail, not conch? Do you realize how stupid all this sounds? We're all like buying into the system, pretending it's real. But it's not. Why do we listen? Maybe you don't have conches because you didn't pick a team. Epic fail, but they only show up on the gotcha screen, so it's hard to- I'll, I'll, I'll go to the gotcha screen if that's what it takes. Uh, no, I have two. And they go away after the Splatfest? I got some yummy treats. Not my sweets. Not my treats. I just want cool clothes, dude. I don't care about- I don't care about the experience. Maybe experience can earn clothes. This is the thing. <laughs> Alright, well... With that, I think that's going to be uh, where I call it for Splatoon 3 tonight. Uh, at least regarding the multiplayer, you know. <gasps> Gender! Hey, I've got one of those. Um, I just hope that I, that I don't come to regret my choice, but, but we'll see. In the meantime, we're going to be doing the story mode for the next two hours. So we're interested in that. Stick around. I know I am, so I will. And I'll see you guys in just a bit. Hold on, I gotta do like a trick shot. Off of this, into the hole. Awesome.